Hello and welcome to Hardware Husky. Today we'll be looking at how to update your Asus motherboard using Easy Flash Free. So the first thing you have to do is enter the BIOS to check the version. You can either do this by pressing Delete or F2. Once in the BIOS, it will either be up here on your main screen. If it's not, you might have to change from Easy Mode to Advanced Mode by pressing F7. Another way you can check the BIOS version is using a program called CPU-Z. Okay, once you download it and you open it, you press this mainboard tab here and the BIOS version should be down here in the BIOS section. So now that you have your BIOS version number, note it down and we have to download the BIOS. One thing you'll need is a USB memory stick. So grab yourself one and open your browser. You'll want to type in your uh, motherboard make and model. So this one's Asus B450F Gaming 2. So you type this into Google and it should bring up the results. So go over, click on the official Asus ROG link. Here, there we go. And it'll bring you to the Asus page. From here, you want to go over to support which is on the right hand side of this page and then you want to click on drivers and tools which is just on this main bar here there we go and you want to click on bars and firmware and then you can see that there's the current version you have there 4007 or whatever version you have and here's a newer version with a new date, this one's 4204. So you want to go ahead and download this file by just clicking on the uh, download button here. Shouldn't take a moment to download. So once that's downloaded, you want to open up the file where you've downloaded it, the folder where you've downloaded it. Double click on it, and then you can see the BIOS there and then you want to open up your memory stick you want to right click on your memory stick and select format make sure it's FAT32 you can rename it whatever you want and make sure you click quick format and press start this shouldn't take a moment and once it's done you'll be able to put the file on okay here's it ready you close it open up the stick and drag over this cap file once that's transferred over you'll want to restart the PC and go back into the BIOS now once your PC has restarted you want to get back into the BIOS by the same way by pressing delete or F2 to access the BIOS settings now that you're in the BIOS you want to make sure it's in advanced mode by pressing F7 I believe and then you'll like to click over here on tools once you clicked on tools you want to click on asus easy flash free utility over on this screen you want to select your usb memory stick on the left hand side under storage devices once you have that you'll be able to see your cap file with the bars version number go ahead and click on that once you do that it'll ask you do you really want to update the bios so make sure all the information is correct before you press yes so this is the right motherboard, this is the right version. I'll click on yes and I'll update the BIOS. This process will take a few minutes, so don't turn your computer off or anything and leave it. And when it asks you to restart, restart it. And then you'll want to go back into BIOS screen again by pressing delete or F2. Once you're back in the BIOS screen, make sure you've it's uploaded correctly and it's the correct version. After that, you'll want to enable your XMP again if you had that enabled. Set up your fan profiles or any overclock settings you might have. And one last note, when updating the BIOS, make sure there's no children or animals that can knock your plug out when updating. And if possible, use an uninterrupted power supply when doing this. And basically, that's it on how to update your BIOS. I hope you liked the video and found it useful. Please subscribe, like and comment down below and I hope I'll see you again.